Did you know that besides layers, Photoshop has another powerful tool? It's called channels. This is where an image is split into three basic colors, red, green, and blue, RGB. If a photo contains a lot of red, the red channel will appear bright. The green and blue channels have less color information, so they look darker or even gray. If the photo is dominated by green, the green channel will be the brightest. The red and blue channels will look dimmer. And if blue is the main color, the blue channel will stand out as the brightest. The rule is simple. The brighter the channel, the more that color is present in the image. Next, let's look at the basic principle. First, create a new layer. In the Channels panel, choose the red channel. Click to load the selection. Go back to Layers, add an empty layer, and fill it with pure red. Then deselect, create another empty layer, and hide the red layer you just made. Do the same for green and blue. Turn on all three, and the picture looks strange. Why? Because we don't have black. Add a black layer at the bottom, change blend mode to screen, and now the image looks just like the original. That's the core idea of how channels work. Application 1. Background Extraction. Channels are perfect for extracting tricky backgrounds. Take a photo of a tree with lots of thin branches. Normal selection tools will struggle. Compare the three channels. Choose the one with the strongest contrast, often the blue channel. Duplicate it and boost contrast with levels. Click the Load Selection icon to create a selection. By default, the white area is selected. If you need the tree, invert the selection with Ctrl plus Shift plus I. Press Ctrl plus J to put it on a new layer. Now the tree is perfectly extracted even the fine details. Application 2. Brightening Skin Another trick, use channels to brighten skin. In a dark portrait, pick the channel with the most detail, usually red. Load it as a selection, copy it to a new layer, and change the blend mode to screen. The face brightens instantly. For a natural result, add a mask. Use a soft brush to hide the effect on areas you don't want. This is also a common method for skin brightening actions, making retouching faster and more consistent. Application 3. Enhancing Texture Channels can also enhance fine textures. Think of a wedding dress with beads and lace. In the Channels panel, pick the channel with the most detail. Here it's blue. Duplicate it. Adjust contrast with levels and load the selection. Back in Layers, add a Curves adjustment to lift highlights slightly. Then create a subtle high pass layer. Set to Overlay. And use the same mask to sharpen only the dress. The result? Lace and beads sparkle with clarity, while skin and background remain smooth. Extra tip channels can also isolate highlights to create a soft, dreamy glow effect. I've made a separate video on that. Check the card above. So, channels are not just for colors. They help you extract backgrounds, brighten portraits, and enhance textures. If this was helpful, drop a comment and hit like and subscribe for more tips. Thank you very much.